Merry Christmas, everybody. When the girls and boys are born all around the world, a fairy is born for every girl and elf for every boy. They live right near the girls and boys and know they can't be seen. If you feel it, whoosh of wind, you'll know that they have been. In the tree, as high as you can see, they live inside the snuggery. The fairies, the golden fairy harmony and rhapsody, her friend at the bottom of the garden. The fairies. When little girls and boys are born all around the world, a fairy is born for every girl and elf for every boy. They live right near the girls. I'm Harmony. And I'm Rhapsody. We live here at Fairyland in the bottom of the garden. Our snuggery is at the top of the old gum tree where we sleep. We call Rhapsody Rainbow Rhapsody because her fairy dress is all the colours of the rainbow. And we call Harmony the Golden Fairy because gold is her favourite, favourite colour. It's a fantastic time of year for the colour gold. Do you know it's that special, magical, wonderful time of year when friends come around visiting and we have lots of <laughs> presents and yummy food to eat. And Santa Claus visits us and we tie fairy bells on our wands so we can jingle wherever we go. <laughs> Rhapsody. Do you think we should sing the fairy bell song for all the boys and girls? Oh, I think that's a great idea, Harmony. Maybe you can join in too, especially in the bit where we shout, Hey! <laughs> You sure did hear fairy bells, Barnaby. Does that mean? Does that mean? Oh, you know, fairy bells only happen around Christmas time. Hey, does that mean Christmas time is nearly here? <laughs> fairy bells. I'm sure I heard fairy bells. Hello, Elf the Fairy Cake Maker. Hello, Harmony. Hello, Rhapsody. Hello, Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee. Is it true? Did I really hear fairy bells? You certainly did hear fairy bells, Elf the Fairy Cake Maker. It's that magical, wonderful Christmas time of year when they've got the tree to decorate, we've got presents to choose and wrap, we've got the bottom of the garden to fill with fairy lights. And the fairy light concert. Don't forget about that, Harmony. <laughs> Why don't we sing the song that tells all the children that he's on his way? Who's on his way? Oh, you know him! You don't mean... Yes! Do you mean... Yes! <laughs> yes, yes! Santa Claus is on his way! <laughs>
Granny, we've tied fairy bells onto our wands and we've started singing the children some Christmas songs. Do you think now it's time for the Christmas tree? I think you might be right, Rhapsody. We've got bells on the end of our wands. We've been singing songs to get us into the Christmas mood. I think it is time for the Christmas tree. <laughs> well, we need Barnaby and Elf's help. Where are they? They were with us just a second ago. Barnaby! Elf! Barnaby! Where are you? Elf! Here I am. I'm here. What's going on? Hi, Elf. We found out it's time to put the Christmas tree up. Do you want to help us? I sure would, fairies. That'd be great fun. <laughs> Now all we need is Barnaby to help us out. Shall we call him? Yes, after Fairy 3. Fairy 1, Fairy 2, Fairy 3. Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee! Oh, I don't think he heard us. Well, let's try that again. After 3, a bit louder this time. Fairy 1, Fairy 2, Fairy 3. Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee! Oh, he must be a long way away. Maybe you can help us this time. After Fairy 3. Fairy one, fairy two, fairy three, Barnaby the busy buzzy bee! I'm here! I'm here! I was back behind the bushes! What's up? What's happening? Calm down, Barnaby. You're buzzing around like a busy buzzy bee. Well, I am a busy buzzy bee. Oh, oh, what's up? What's happening? <laughs> Barnaby, it's time to put up the Christmas tree. Do you want to help us? Oh, I'd be delighted to help you. Well, where should we put the tree, Harmony? I think just about there would be perfect. Absolutely perfect. <laughs> I'm going to need some extra special magic to help make the tree really beautiful. I think the magic wand song would be perfect. Sparkling magic fairy wand, glittering magic fairy wand, special magic fairy wand. I saw it, I saw it. It was really faint, but I'm sure I saw it. Take it on the first, Harmony. Twinkling magic fairy wand, starry magic fairy wand, special magic fairy wand, please make magic now. I saw it this time. Quick, sing another verse. Shining magic fairy wand, pretty magic fairy wand, special magic fairy wand, please make magic now. Wow. Oh, what a beautiful tree, Harmony. Ooh, look. And such lovely decorations. But look, something else is appearing. <gasps> Goodness gracious me. What is it, Harmony? It's a really pretty box. Let me put my hand in and see what happens. <gasps> it's a magic decoration box. Oh, how wonderful. Try it, Rhapsody. Okay. Magic your wand is creating today, Harmony. You have a turn, Barnaby and Elf. Beautiful! Beautiful, I say! Look! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Such a lovely Christmas sight. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree, you look so very pretty. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree, you look so very pretty. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree, you look so very This gorgeous gold tinsel was well, just like your dress, Harmony. And it will finish off the tree perfectly. Isn't it beautiful? <laughs>
Guess what's next on the Christmas list, Harmony? Let's see now. We've tied fairy bells on our wands. We've put up the Christmas tree. It must be time to wrap Christmas presents. <laughs> no, that's not it. Oh. Is it time to make beautiful Christmas cards for all our friends? <gasps> no, that's not it either. Would you like a hint? Yes, please. OK, a big hint. We have to invite all of our friends down to the bottom of the garden when the sun has gone down and the garden is twinkling with fairy lights and we sing... I know, we sing, we sing, we sing Christmas carols. <laughs> it's time to organise carols by fairy lights. That's right. There's so much work to be done, but I think the first thing we should do is work out who we're going to invite. I hope Arabella and her friends can come. Arabella's not a fairy. She lives at the top of the garden, but I know she likes to dress up as a fairy whenever she can. And of course there's Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee and Elf the Fairy Cake Maker and all the Elf Tots and Fairy Tots. And don't forget the jolly old man in the bright red suit. Oh, Santa Claus. Oh, I'm so excited. You know, I wish it was the carols by fairy light right now. <laughs> Perhaps, Rhapsody, we should fly to the top of the garden and see if Arabella and William and Emily can come to carols by fairy light. Oh, that now. would be fantastic. Fantastic! Oh, I feel like doing some flying and I'd really like it if you'd sing my favourite Christmas carol. You sing away in a manger so well. That sounds a great idea, Rhapsody. Let's get flying. Bella, my little fairy child. Hello, Emily. Hi, William. Hi, Harmony. Hi, Rhapsody. You know how it's that special, magical, wonderful time of the year with lots of friends visiting and yummy food and Christmas carols and presents. And Santa's getting ready to visit all the children on Christmas Eve. We know we're already making Christmas cards for all our friends and we've been learning some Christmas carols. That's just perfect, because at this magical time of year, we always have a concert in the bottom of the garden. It's called Carols by Fairy Light, and we'd love you to come. We'd love to come to Carols by Fairy Light concert. You'll have to ask your parents if it's OK for the three of you to come to the bottom of the garden. And the garden will be filled with lots of Christmas balloons and twinkling with fairy lights. It will look absolutely beautiful. We'd better go now, Rhapsody. We've got to ask the Elf Tots and the Fairy Tots and Barnaby and Elf. And the jolly old man in the bright red suit. <laughs> See you at the Carols by Fairy Light. Goodbye. 
jolly old man in a bright red suit. Do you think that could possibly mean that Santa Claus is going to be at the Carols by Fairlight concert? Harmony, something's missing. We have our Christmas tree and all its decorations, but somehow it just doesn't seem Christmassy. I know what's missing, Rhapsody. There aren't any presents under the Christmas tree. Oh, you're right. Even one present would help. I know what we can do, Rhapsody. We know what we're giving Arabella for Christmas. We could wrap up a copy of the fairy book. Oh, then it would really feel like Christmas was nearly here. That's a fabulous idea, Harmony. I'll go and find the book. You go and find some paper and we'll meet under the Christmas tree. OK. <gasps> Rhapsody, I found the book and I've got a fabulous fairy pen so we can write something to Arabella in the front of the book. Oh, that will make it extra special. And I've got everything that we need to wrap the present up with. Hey, what should we write in the book, Harmony? What about... With love and hugs from Harmony and Rhapsody. Perfect! Just perfect! Well, let's do it. Do you think Arabella will like her Christmas present? Aren't books fantastic? Well, I'm feeling really Christmassy now and my wings are starting to wiggle. You know what that means. <laughs> do you know what I think we should do, Rhapsody? I think we should sing the song At the Bottom of the Garden. Yes! Everybody knows that. But we can change the words to make it Christmassy. <gasps> Great idea. what Arabella and her friends are doing right now. Well, why don't you use your magic mirror and find out? Great idea. Rhapsody, can you use your magic wand to bring us the magic mirror? Magic fairy wand, so dear. Please make the magic mirror appear. having a great time, aren't they? Well, now it's time we went to the bottom of the tree and tried to find Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee and Elf the Fairy Cake Maker. We need to tell them about the Carols by Fairy Light concert. Well, let's go and find them now. Here they are. Oh, you're just who we need to speak to, Barnaby and Elf. We're organising the Carols by Fairy Light concert. Would you two like to come? We, we love to, to fairies, <laughs> and you know how I love to sing Christmas carols. Yeah, because this Barnaby wasn't feeling very happy, and, and, and I thought that if he could sing a really happy Christmas song, it would make him feel better. But it's been so long since last Christmas, we've forgotten all of our Christmassy songs. Do you know what we could do? We could sing the tra la 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 song. Only we could all make up our own silly verse. Oh, that's a great idea, Harmony. <laughs> and then it'd be a very silly Christmas <laughs> song. <laughs> Why don't you see if you can sing along with us?
That's made me feel so Christmassy. I think I'll have to go and make some Christmassy fairy cakes. Bye, Bye, Bye. Bye. Oh, Barnaby, you're not looking like a very happy, busy, buzzy bee. What's wrong? I think I've lost my Christmas spirit. You know, at Christmas you're supposed to feel so joyful and so happy, but I feel a little bit sad and a bit grumpy. I think I've lost my Christmas spirit. <laughs> See oh, you later. No, Barnaby's lost his Christmas spirit. spirit. Harmony, what is a Christmas spirit? I don't know, but if he's lost it at the bottom of the garden, we'll just have to find it for him. Right. Barnaby, just what his Christmas spirit looks like, mm. how big it is, what colour it is, perhaps what noise it makes. You're right, it would be a lot easier to find it if we knew what it looked like. Let's find Barnaby. Okay. Barnaby! 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 Rhapsody! Guess what? Guess what? Barnaby, calm down. You're buzzing around like a busy, buzzy bee. Well, I am a busy, buzzy bee, and I can't slow down. I'm too excited. I've got my Christmas spirit back. Oh, fan fairy -tastic. We looked all over the bottom of the garden, but we couldn't find it anywhere. Oh, you won't find the Christmas spirit at the bottom of the garden. It's the Christmassy mood you're in, the joyful, busy, buddy feeling. It's inside you. <laughs> We've been silly fairies. <laughs> so you mean it's like that Christmassy feeling when you decorate the tree or give presents to each other, when you feel so happy you just want to sing and dance. That's the Christmassy feeling. That's the Christmas spirit. Exactly, Rhapsody. <laughs> so when you wrap up a surprise for your friends and you want to race around and tell them what's in the package, but you can't, because that'd spoil the secret. <laughs> That's the Christmas spirit? Exactly, Harmony. Well, where did you find it? First, I found the fairy tot who'd torn her wing on a rose thorn. So I sewed it up with some special thread. And then I found an elf tot who was carrying a really, really heavy bag full of letters that Santa Claus had written to all the children. So I carried the bag while he popped all the letters in the children's letter boxes. <gasps> yes. And then I realised my Christmas spirit had come back. Oh. See, you know why? It was because I was doing something for somebody else and I wasn't thinking about myself. Oh, that's a beautiful story, Barnaby. It makes me feel so happy. I just want to cry. No, Rhapsody. It makes you feel so happy you want to sing. Yes. <laughs> oh, do you think we could sing the Christmas rock song? But we can't sing it unless we ask my special friend Elf to come and join us. That's a fan fairy fantastic idea, Barnaby. <laughs> Let's call him, shall we? Elf oh, the, the fairy cake maker. Did you call me fairies? We sure did, Elf. Would you like to help us sing the Christmas rock song? That'd be great.
Christmas rock, it'll rock your socks. The Christmas rock, it'll rock your socks. The Christmas rock, it'll rock your socks. Oh, I do love the Christmas rock song. Do you know it's only two days until Christmas? <laughs> Tomorrow night is Christmas Eve and the garden will be twinkling with fairy lights. <laughs> and do you know we'll have the carols by fairy light concert in the bottom of the garden with all the fairy tots and the elf tots. And Arabella, William and Emily. <laughs> yes, and late tomorrow night when all the children are fast asleep. Santa Claus and his reindeer will visit every home and deliver a special present to every boy and girl. <laughs> I've been practicing to sing on the carols by fairy light concert and I can't get my voice right. It's not smooth. I'll give it one more go. Silent night, holy night. Oh, oh, oh I think I'm going to need some help if I want to get a nice smooth voice. What's wrong, Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee? Well, I've been practicing to sing on the carols by fairy light concert and my voice is not very smooth at all. Can you help me? Oh, Barnaby, you've been practicing so hard, it's got a little bit rough. <laughs> Would you like me to make some special magic so you sound like a honeybee, not a busy buzzy bee? Yes, please! Oh, and please, 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 could I have a special costume? Certainly you can, Barnaby. Well, thank you! Are you ready? Yeah! Silent night, holy night All is calm, all is bright Round yon virgin mother and child Your practicing was well worth it. You sang Silent Night beautifully. Thank you for giving me that honey bee voice and that wonderful costume. I'm ready now to sing at the carols by fairy light. Oh, all that singing about Silent Night has made me feel really, really sleepy. I think it's time for my sleepy dreams in the snuggery. Are you ready to come to bed? I'm ready. Are you ready for your sleepy dreams in your busy, buzzy bed, Barnaby? I think I'll buzz off now. Good night fairies, good night fairies, good night fairies, it's time for sleepy dreams. Happily I buzz away, buzz away, buzz away, happily I buzz away, it's time for sleepy dreams.
I had some fabulous dreams last night, Harmony. It must have been all the excitement after finding Barnaby's Christmas spirit and singing the Christmas rock song. I dreamt that it was Christmas Eve and we were organising the carols by fairy light and Santa Claus was coming. Isn't that a great dream? <laughs> You've done it again, you funny rainbow rhapsody. That's not a dream, that's what's really happening. <gasps> Today is Christmas Eve, and tonight the garden will be twinkling with fairy lights and we're having carols by fairy light concert. And Santa Claus will be delivering presents to all the boys and girls all over the world. <laughs> well, we better get flying and get organised. It's OK. We've got lots of time. It's only morning. And last night we made all the Christmas cards for our friends and we wrapped all the Christmas presents. Oh, we did too. Thank heavens for that. We can relax all day long. As long as we get the garden decorated in time for the Carols by Fairy Light concert. Rhapsody, the garden has to be just beautiful tonight for Carols by Fairy Light. Yes, you'd better use some of your best magic harmony. Rhapsody, your wings are wiggling and the magic wand is shaking. I think it might be going to do something really special. <gasps> Fairy one, that's just, it's just, I can't think of words good enough to describe how beautiful the garden oh, looks. Oh, it is, and we have to share it with everybody really quickly. We need to go and collect Arabella, William and Emily. I'm sure they'll be waiting for us. I'm just so excited. It's great that Mummy let us play until bedtime. I wonder if she notices we're wearing our special clothes. I think your mum's pretty clever. Maybe she knows the fairies have asked us to cows by fairy light. She was young once, you know, a long time ago. Fairy, fairy Merry Christmas. Christmas! Fairy Merry Christmas! We've nearly finished our Christmas cards. Can you help us, please? Oh, we'd love to help you, but we'll have to make ourselves bigger first. Tigger, jigger, rimini, digger, magic wand, please make us bigger. And we went to the Carols by Fairy Light concert. Come on, everybody, put your cards down, gather in close, close your eyes really tightly. Are you ready? Bittle, fittle, fittle rimini, skittle, magic wand, please make us little. Look, he 
Here come the fairy tots and elf tots. Hello, fairy tots and elf tots. Hello, everybody. Fairy Merry Christmas. Hello, everybody. Fairy Merry Christmas. <gasps> fairy Merry Christmas, Barnaby and Elf. Well, is this everybody? Well, somehow it seems like there's someone missing. I think you're right, Rhapsody. And I can hear him coming now. <gasps> Look! Ho, ho, ho! Look! It's Santa Claus! Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas, everybody! Very Merry Christmas, Santa Claus! <laughs> now, everybody is here. Why don't we let the carols by fairy light begin? Yay! Yay! Down to your seats, everybody. <laughs> Thanks, Elf. Over here. That's the way. Oh. Sit down, Rhapsody. Joy to the world, the Lord is come. Let earth receive a King. Let every heart prepare. for a Christmas song all by ourselves and we'd love to sing it to everyone. <gasps> fan fairy tastic well, What's the song called? The Eight Days of Christmas. <gasps> we'd love to hear it. <gasps> oh, lovely. So lovely. Don't the Eight Days of Christmas. All by themselves. All by themselves. On the first day of Christmas a fairy sent to me a feather from a baby bird. Buddy. On the fourth day of Christmas, a fairy sent. 
oh, oh. I think it's time for all the children and the fairy tots and the elf tots to brush their teeth, put on their <coughs> gym jams and close their eyes. Now, now you have a beautiful sleepy dream lullaby that my elves sing to me at night. Do you think you could sing that for the little ones to help them feel sleepy? Us too, Santa. We'd, We'd like to hear it too. And me, I love it when you sing that song. I'd love to sing in the land of sleepy dreams. Why don't you run and grab something that you can cuddle? A teddy? A doll perhaps? Or even a special friend? And I'll sing it for everybody. In the land of sleepy dreams, you can dream all night. In the land of sleepy dreams, everything's alright. Just close your eyes while sleep does. Spring goes through. Better go and make sure that the reindeers have had something to eat and something to drink. We've got a long night ahead of us, delivering presents to all the boys and girls. So, good night, everybody, and a very Merry Christmas. Very, very Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas, Santa Claus. Do you think I should use some extra special fairy magic and put all the elf tots and fairy tots and Arabella, William and Emily right into their snug little beds. Oh, that's a lovely idea, Harmony. I wonder if all the children all around the world are fast asleep. Well, it's Christmas Eve, and all children know that Santa Claus can't visit them until they're tucked up in bed in the land of sleepy dreams. I wonder if Santa's loaded up his famous sleigh and fed the reindeer their hay. Well, why don't you give him a call on the fairy phone and tell him that all the children are asleep and he can deliver the presents now. Great idea, Rhapsody. Magic fairy wand so dear, please make the fairy phone appear. Hello, Santa, it's Harmony speaking. Thanks for coming to the Carols by Fairy Light. 
We hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. It, it was, how do you say it, a fan fairy tastic harmony. <laughs> it, is everything quiet now at the bottom of the garden? All the boys and girls all over the world are fast asleep, Santa. Ho, ho, ho. That means we can deliver their presents. The elves have loaded up the sleigh and the reindeer are waiting, so I guess it's time. Thank you, Harmony, and goodbye. Goodbye. Santa's ready to deliver all the presents to all the boys and girls everywhere around the world. <sighs> all of a sudden, I'm feeling really tired. I think it's time for me to go to bed. Me too. Betsy, look, look. Santa Claus has come in the middle of the night and left us this present. Gosh, isn't he incredible? I thought with all the other boys and girls he has to deliver presents to. All over the world. That he just wouldn't have time for us. Do you know, I think that just goes to show Santa has time for everybody. How about we go to the bottom of the garden and see if anyone else is awake yet? That's a great idea, Harmony. Let's go. Harmony Rhapsody, look! Look! Santa Claus came in the middle of the night and he left me this present! It's Barnaby! Santa been to me too! Look, fairies, he left me this present! Oh, aren't we all so lucky? Look, look! Santa Claus came to us as well! Oh, look! Oh, look. Uh, uh, this is just so exciting! How about we all put our presents under the Christmas tree and we can open them later on? <laughs> Oh, look what's happened in the middle of the night. <gasps> I wonder if Santa Claus has left these presents for all the other people in the bottom of the garden. Do you know what I think the best thing is about Christmas? The Christmas spirit! Friends, wonderful friends. The really yummy food. No, I think the best thing... Yes? <laughs> I think the best thing... Yes? I think the best thing is... The music!
do you think is the best thing about Christmas? Is it the fabulous food or the presents? Or do you like the music and dancing the best? Yeah. Whatever you think's the best thing from all of us at the bottom of the garden, from Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee, from Elf the Fairy Cake Maker, from Rhapsody, from all the little fairy tots and elf tots, and last of all from me, we wish you a very Merry Christmas. <laughs> Close your eyes. Open your imagination. Make believe. Think big. And go purple. Party! Whoa! You better get started having fun right now. Okay, okay, let's go. Now there's finally a screen that's big enough for Barney. <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> A movie the whole family will love. Join Barney, Baby Bob, and BJ in the magical musical adventure every young child has been waiting for. Let's go! Okay. 
Prepare for takeoff, Captain! The biggest adventures begin with a little imagination. Barney's Great Adventure, the movie. Lots of fun! <laughs> I'm Harmony. And I'm Rhapsody. Fairies? I don't believe it. We love the fairy ring. It makes us dance and sing. We make good magic when we flutter our wings. Hi, I'm Rhapsody. Come and meet me and my friend Harmony and all of our special friends from the bottom of the garden for loads of fun. I'm peekabooing again. Where is she? I'm here. She's where? She's there. She's tricky, she's quirky, she's really good fun. I'm peekabooing again. Oh, can we sing at the bottom of the garden, everyone? Please, please, please. It's a lovely day to be with friends. At the bottom of the garden. At the bottom of the garden. Dee dee dee. Doo doo doo. Little green elf, how we love you. We have a great time in the garden, singing and dancing with our friends Elf the Fairy Cake Maker and Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee. Hello, Arabella, my little fairy child. You look very pretty in your party dress. Are you ready to become very small and come with us? There are fairies at the bottom of my garden. Fairies just as real as you and me. One day, Arabella, Emily and William, from the top of the garden, were invited to a surprise party with the fairy and elf tots for Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's birthday. So we made them very small like us and had a fan fairy tastic time. When you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. When you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Now we have to go. Now we have to go. We'd like to show you our special fairy garden and to meet our friends and join in with our songs. See you soon. <laughs>